Hey, this is Oase with OpenTrader, and uh, this video is going to cover the context heading into Wednesday, September 19th, and just cover some ideas for remainder of the week. So last week, the S&P 500 broke out to uh, new yearly highs, and uh, we can see that over here. And following that breakout now, ES has been consolidating within a range, but uh, this is pretty typical behavior following a breakout. And uh, as long as we can hold above uh, 1443, the idea is that we're gonna get continuation and a push to new yearly highs. Uh, so far, we've been seeing that buyers have been active on pullbacks into support. Uh, we can see that uh, 1449 has held nicely a couple of times over here, and then on the retest on Tuesday. Uh, buyers entered a couple of ticks ahead of that again and pushed it back up. So at this point, the key level that we're going to be looking at is uh, 1456 half. And if buyers can push it above that, we expect some acceleration to the upside. And uh, we have that uh, naked BPOC that's open at 1462 quarter. And that would be the minimum upside objective above 1456 half. On the downside, we want the S&P to hold above 1450 at this point. Um, any break below it would bring in uh, 1446.75 and 14.43 as uh, downside objectives. And uh, we'll be looking for responsive buyers to enter at those levels uh, in the event of a break below because we're still in a uh, bullish context. Uh, the S&P is still within uh, the breakout mode and um, We'll still be looking for long opportunities on pullbacks and the support. So those are some ideas heading into Wednesday. And um, I hope you guys found this video useful um, and uh, it helps you put together some of your own trading ideas. Um, if you could, please uh, leave a comment below. Let us know what you thought of the video. And um, if you could also do us a favor and just let us know how the sound quality is on your end. Because, uh, you know, we're still kind of tweaking our audio setup or mic setup and uh, we're getting varying feedback on how the sound is actually coming out. Is it too low? Is it too high? Uh, you know, we'd really appreciate it if you could just leave a quick comment and uh, let us know how this is coming out on your end. Thanks and uh, we'll catch you in the next Outlook video.